Good morning, everyone. I am in full swing of packing our stuff because tomorrow morning we're leaving very early to Vimeo. I'm going to see my niece. I'm going to, I can't wait. Um, but first, we're going to go to Stockholm all day long. So I'm packing right now so that we're somewhat ready to go uh, when we get home tonight. Um, I have a big day planned. <laughs> So this street right here, that's where the terrorist attack happened. Where? What street? This street. Oh shit. Yeah. So you see um, that big mall up there? That's where it crashed into. Yeah. I haven't been in here in years. So let's go downstairs. Okay. <laughs> but they have <laughs> This is your place or what? Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Man, oh man. Rob, what you got on this, Rob? <laughs> look at this. Tordini of a chanterelles. Wow, look at those. That's my thing right there. Wow. Yeah, Rob should come here, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a bunch of stuff. Bro, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> it never ends. Seriously. This is the meat palace. Oh shit. These are like meats that I haven't even heard of. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, can I buy one of those? Thank you. Your Swedish is getting good. You read it. You knew that I was garlic bread. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? What are you going to try right now? Some reindeer. For the first time. Jerky reindeer. Rudolph jerky. <laughs> What do you think? <laughs> Nothing like you ever had? Fuck Christmas, this is delicious. Really? Oh my god, this is the best turkey I've ever had in my life. Really? Yeah. Oh wow. I didn't know reindeer was that good. <laughs> mm. It's like the perfect amount of like fat balance versus meat and it's nice and juicy. Um, texture's not bad, it's good. Um, it looks pretty rough to eat, like hard. Oh, but it's jerky. It's great. Yeah. Ah, oh. oh, look, and now here. Look at this. <laughs> so, so yeah, we've been traveling a little bit, and we're comparing. Um, well, now it's Skagen toast, but toast Skagen. Yes, yeah, um, same thing. We're comparing it at different places. So this one looks pretty damn good, though. I don't know. That's delicious. Did you try some? Yeah. Skagen? No, but that uh, jerky. I can eat this all day. <laughs> Which one won? I Best could live here. <laughs> Best the corner this oh, one. Yeah. This is the better one. The it's very similar. This is, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. You know what's funny too? We talked about this, is that we talked about how we don't think service is that good in Scandinavia at restaurants. But at this restaurant, they're actually really good. They're like super hands on. Bro. Mm. I got my food like that. Piccolino. I think it's called Piccolino. Mm. At Hertor's Hotland. So we just got done having lunch, and um, our Jamaican waiter was uh, 
super genuine to me <clears throat> and I was ready to tip them out all fat and then I realized here in Sweden they don't really do tips it's all just included so yeah. I thought that was kind of cool <laughs> but he was a really nice guy I'd also like to add one more thing it's really cool to be perceived as strong because uh, the, 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 the Jamaican waiters I, I, I said good call on uh, uh, giving me the whole entire uh, Skagen toast because uh, there's a there's an option of either half or whole. So I chose a whole, and he said, yeah, man, it's because you're strap, man. And it's nice to be perceived as strong, uh, because the first part of my life, half of my life, I was uh, I was more in comparison to the shrimp on my Skagen toast, so. We're waiting for a train day. For a pram. A trolley tram train. <laughs> a trolley tram <trammy> train. <laughs> Here's the pretty Nordic Museum, but we're not going to go in there, actually. We're going to... Where? Okay. <laughs> the Vasa Museum. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look, here's the museum. <laughs> Looks like a ship on the outside, too. I have no idea why there are two clowns in front of the museum. Hey, there's clowns! <laughs> so we're in the Vasa Museum right now, and I think it's really cool Vasa. that kids up to 18 actually go for free. Yeah, I told them I was five. <laughs> I see it. It's huge. Oh my god. Whoa. Oi, look at the size of that boom. <laughs> wow. Okay, this is crazy. So this is King Vasa's ship that sunk and they restored it and they got it back from the, the water that it was in. I don't know if it was in the ocean or in the lake, but they restored it. It was huge. Can you believe how old this is? I don't even know exactly how old it is. I don't know how to even get a picture with the ship, but because <laughs> there's so many people here. Damn, look at the details on that thing. That's some old wood right there. <laughs> 300, 500 years old? Yeah, something like that. Pretty. You can even see the inside is like lit up. Looks like a ghost ship. <laughs> Look at those carved out details in the front too. I don't know what happened. I can't remember. I read about it in history in school, so I should know this stuff. But <laughs> I think I remember it just didn't even go, go very far at all. No. So that was one of the women who died, her name was, they named it Viva. These were her shoes, they were still intact when they um, restored it. So like hundreds of years later, they found her shoes still pretty much intact. It's crazy. What do you think of this Scandinavian history lesson you're getting? I think it's fucking really interesting, awesome. It makes my mind wonder how much other shit is buried at the bottom of the ocean that they haven't even found yet. One thing that I like that they mentioned here is that the women, it didn't really matter what gender you had back in the day. It did matter, but like their work and the farms and, you know, to like make the world go round was more appreciated back then. Then yeah. it kind of became like a separated thing where women weren't as equal as to men. Men has always been like, you know, the kings or whatever, but the women had quite a lot of power over the household and stuff back in the day. I like that. That's really interesting. The thing about the women being in charge too of the villages and having a lot of power over them is because the men were away to war so much. So the women were left to deal with everything themselves. So they had all the power at the households and everything. And the decision making. I like that. Well, this, this was the other woman who was found on the ship. Well, they like really restored her. They tried. She was find, found close to the body of a man, so researchers believe that they died together. So maybe that was like a relative of hers or something. 
She's probably pretty full, poor, but she had nice shoes. Yeah, that's creepy looking. Yeah, they can kind of guess what she looked like. That's really cool. Did a really good job. Yeah, it says that they can read from like her teeth. They think she was about 25. Really? She's yeah. She's fucking old. I think she sewed a lot during her life because she had um, 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 calluses on her hands. No, like on no. her, um, <laughs> in her um, uh, right uh, cheek, like teeth. She, it looks like she would like um, bite off a thread a, a lot. It's not crazy oh, wow. that they can like figure that out. Jeez, that's amazing. Yeah. I wonder what that's made out of. So is her head. It's a scientific re reconstruction built on an exact copy of the real skull. The face has been built up step by step using artificial muscles, muscles and tissues. Like guessing what she would look like. Yeah. I wish we can like step on board of the ship, but yeah. I get that they don't want to like ruin it or open <laughs> that shit to the public. Right. They probably spent so much time and money restoring it. <laughs> it's weird. I don't want to leave it. Like I know we have other things to do today, but it feels wrong to like walk away and just be like, no, we're done. We've seen enough of this. It feels like we should like stand up. I don't take it in, you know? No. I'm just glad that we took a moment from our lives to check this out. Yeah. It's really cool. There's a lot of people taking it. Oh. <laughs> Titanic feel here. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> okay. Say bye bye, ship. Bye bye, ship. Look what we're gonna buy. Hold it up. It's a little diver from, you know, the salvaging of the ship. Found some candy, some Vasa candy. Oh my gosh, you can't get all that. Okay. What about those two? You're not gonna get those two. Oh my god. Okay, let's 